Yahoo! Welcome back to another Movies 90. Today we're gonna to be talking about the Super Mario Bros. movie. Bowser is coming. I'm not afraid. I'll do anything for my brother. We're going to save him. The Super Mario Bros. movie stars Chris Pratt, Charlie Day, Anya Taylor Johnson, Kigo Michael Key, and Jack Black. After Luigi gets kidnapped by Bowser, it's up to Mario and Princess Peach to save him. So this one of course is a movie adaption from the video game. Right off the bat, let me just say that the animation in this movie was beautiful. Everything looked amazing. Every world had its differences and it just brought a nostalgic feeling back from the video games. If you played the video games, you are not going to be disappointed from this movie. There are also so many easter eggs throughout the whole film. When I first saw this trailer, I was not excited about Chris Pratt being the voice of Mario. But they actually do something really smart in this movie to show why he has the accent and why he doesn't have the accent, which made me like Chris Pratt even more as Mario. Chris Pratt was just so much fun and energetic with this. It made Mario more human-like and just such a fun character. But the rest of the voice cast did such an amazing job. Charlie Day as Luigi also killed it. And for me, just the biggest standout, as always, was Jack Black as Bowser. He has a couple of songs in this movie and it just made it really funny. Like I said, this movie was just perfectly cast. I don't see any other actors bringing these voices to life. Like Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong was perfect. They also did change up the Super Mario story just a little bit. It wasn't Princess Peach that needed saving, it was Luigi that needed saving this time. I will say the one flaw to this movie was that there wasn't enough Mario and Luigi interaction. I just wanted more of that. Which didn't hurt the film, I just thought more of it would have been even better. This movie was shorter than I thought, it's only 90 minutes, and I'm like, no, give us more of this. Also, all the songs were perfectly chosen for each scene in this movie. There was a lot of 80s music, which I think fit perfectly for this. And of course, if you listen to the background, you get all of the old school Nintendo sounds. So now the question, would I go watch this movie in the theater again? Yeah, I would love to go watch this movie again. It was just so much fun and the cast really brought all these characters to life. Also, don't leave right after the movie's over. There's a mid credit scene and an after credit scene. Also, I would love to see a sequel to this movie and please bring back the cast. Let me know what you thought about this movie. Did you think each character was casted perfectly or who would you have casted? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Be on the lookout for a new review next week. You know, this costume just makes me want to make Mario noises like Yahoo!